Forensic chemist uses chemical methods, be it color metric or instrumental methods, to identify either controlled substances or explosives or other chemical forensic evidence. Forensic toxicology is closely related. It, it looks for some of the same things, only it's looking for trace levels that might show up in human tissue or blood or bodily fluids. When you're working with a forensic chemistry sample, you could have a bulk drug sample that would be way more than you would need for analysis. Whereas in forensic toxicology, they're looking for probably trace amounts of these things, so they're really pushing the cutting edge of detection for instrumental methods. In organic, things can be difficult for some of the chemical methods we use, so you know, you know they need other methodologies or instrumentation that, that we might not have to test some of the, uh, the inorganic or elemental things.